don't know me and you don't know my style. You haven't seen it yet. You haven't experienced this yet. I'm not really known, yet I'm everywhere. We are not the coast, and we know that. Dallas is literally creating its own identity. We're strengthening from within. Instead of outsourcing, we're, we're weaving the basket from inside. When you realize our art community is larger than Chicago's, and all this other like dormant kind of it's like a sleeping Godzilla. It, you just poke him and he's gonna wake up. We've already created it, it's already here, and all we have to do is just wake it up. The possibility to have the spotlight and to, and to take a moment in the spotlight is more present, and that's an exciting thing for an artist in Dallas. If you're motivated, the response is waiting for you. People in Dallas are waiting to see something happen. so many little scenes happening all over Dallas that they're all connecting now. So all the scenes are in a sense like Petri dishes and they're all their little mold is growing over and starting to touch. Dallas High School. It's been abandoned for years and years, over a decade. It's a landmark, so they can't tear it down, yet it'll take over $10 million to bring to code. And what we want to do is turn this into the largest outdoor gallery in North America. Basically, you make over 100 pieces of artwork, drill it into place, and you could literally have uh, over 30,000 people view this art every day. So you have half of downtown going to work, getting off on the train every morning looking at it. We should be cultivating areas for people to gather and create memories there.